bus. Stuck here now. Here we are in the tiny town, bustling town of Latchford, Ontario. Lots going on here. Lots going on. So I've got three hours to hike to my first campsite, which happens to be exactly how much daylight I think I have. So better get moving. All right, trailhead, we made it. Pretty, pretty. Oh yeah, that is so sweet. Oh man. Look at that view. That's gorgeous. Oh yes. Hello, Hurst Lake. Man, am I happy to see you. Here we go. Well, made it. Ah, that's better. I'm just gonna eat those with nuts, I think. Because as soon as I'm done, I'm going to bed. Alright, I'll try this sucker. I'm gonna burn my tongue, watch this. Oh, yeah, that's hot. Oh, mm. oh look at that steam. Wow. Oh my god, that's good. Good morning. It is 7.45. It's beautiful. Sunny, calm. Mosquitoes. Oh yeah. Uh, last night was right down to the wire. That's why I only filmed with my iPhone because I didn't want to mess around with the tripod and start getting everything all fancy and ready. So, little update. I, uh, I left Mississauga at about 8.30 in the morning, went and caught a Ontario Northland bus and wound up in Latchford, Ontario just after 6 p.m. Long ride, not bad. And uh, I hit the trail just after 6 and I got to this campsite at I believe it was 9.15. So I did about 8 kilometers in 3 hours. It was a uh, Right down to the wire, it was getting dark when I got in here. So, give you a little update on a little tour of the old homestead here. Let's see here. So you got your your fire pit and your lake. Yeah, very good. And Nice cliff opens up over there, kind of cool. And you got the pre-cut wood, which is really awesome. Shovel, rake, bucket. Nice picnic table. And of course, my tiny little tomb tent, which was very cozy last night. It was cold, it was about eight degrees last night. It was nice and warm in there, so. I need coffee.
Ah, now that is some brekkie. Hash browns, souvlaki wrapped with bacon, nice coffee with powdered milk in it, and a delicious apple. Alright, it is 11.25, gonna do a quick little sweep, left everything in pristine shape, no dishes left behind, fire pit cleaned right up, smothered. Pretty. Oh, yeah. How beautiful is that? Looks like we're coming up on a campsite. There's Roosevelt Lake. It's a beauty. Hopefully it's warm enough to swim in it. Oh yeah. Got ourselves a campsite here. Here we go. Let's take a look. Oh yeah. A little more treed than what is my taste, but I'm tired and my legs hurt and that's a beautiful lake, so we're staying. Let's go have a look around. <sighs> Looks like some decent tent spots, so kind of on a bit of a grade though. But hey, nice soft tent spots. Oh yeah, beautiful picnic table, side table. Pre-cut wood. Oh yeah. Okay, so we're scoping out tent spots here and uh, there's two tent spots. Problem is this. There's one, nice, flat. It's even got like a retaining wall, if you will. Except that that giant tree right there, that one, is uncomfortably tall and close to where your tent will be so it's a lightning rod hmm the other one up there nice spot flat up kind of nice drainage all that stuff well appointed all that sort of crap except it's a widow maker look at that thing right boom down on it so what do you do do you go widowmaker or do you go lightning rod tonight with the blue sky of current got to play the uh play the odds i'm sleeping under the lightning rod Espresso coffee tastes mighty good. 
Very relaxing the way that's reflecting the sun like that. It's like a lava lamp. Very cool. Ferocious beast. Good morning, everybody. It's uh, still early. It's only 7.30. I've been up for a while. I was up for the sunrise, lucky enough to catch a beautiful sunrise, the mist on the lake, all that great stuff. The loons were very active last night, singing and chirping and carrying on, which I love. Cash browns. Over easy eggs. Pretty steep. Now here we are overlooking what I believe is Brian Lake or still Roosevelt Lake, not sure. But we're gonna go have a look at Singing Pine Lookout. Let's see, how do we get down there without killing ourselves? That's the question. Oh yeah. Not quite a clean lookout, but beautiful. Blueberries, sweet blueberries. That is a lot of blueberries. Mm. <laughs> okay, folks, it's lunchtime, day four. We stopped here on beautiful Bryan Lake. You got some downpour over there, and maybe some more coming that way, and some distant thunder, and maybe a storm that way. So I'm going to eat some lunch and ride this thing out and if uh, it blows over i'm gonna keep hiking if not staying here tonight it's actually pretty sweet so getting some rain getting some thunder here and there luckily before any of this happened i uh set up good old blue
broccoli I don't know about instant but whatever dehydrated delicious I'm gonna add some couscous Rio Mare I guess I don't know and top it off with some double cheddar cheese Cous tuna topped with a generous helping of double cheddar cheese <laughs> now that is a carbo load Guy's a real go-getter. Yeah, look at that. Without hesitation. Look at this gruesome reaction I'm having to a horsefly bite. At least I think it was a horsefly bite. It's like, <sighs> no, you bastards. You dirty bastards! Give me back my hand! Give me back my hand! You bastards! You dirty Beauty sunrise. of birds 
welcoming me to the... Oh, yes. A loon taking off. Okay, breakfast. So, I'm not uh, going to walk all that far today. <clears throat> so, I'm just going to have some scrambled eggs with cheese and some delicious coffee brewing. I'm trying to get rid of the cheese and I'm going to save the rest of the hash browns for tomorrow morning. Hey, hello. Yes, I'm sweaty. It's hot. Thought I'd share this spectacular view with you here. I don't want to get too close to the edge. That's close enough. You got Rib Lake there. Beauty. And Johnston Lake there. Beauty. Hey, hey, everybody. Here we are at beautiful Hearst Lake, back where we spent night one. All right, last dinner of the trip. Definitely need some heavy carb grub to replenish. We got butter and herb rice. That's right, that's a pile of rice. Nice. And we got couscous tuna. Oh yeah, nice. And Good old double cheddar, shredo cheeso, still good. All right, look at that. I got greasy cheese hands, so I'm gonna just do that instead. Just a beautiful hot morning here. Slept like a baby. All right, we're gonna pack everything down, have some coffee and some eggs and get out of here. Let's get the food down. Pack down mode. Here we go. A few hours to get out of here. Didn't need the air horn this time. 
That's probably a good thing. All right, I will. I love this trail. Walk up the top of this hill and look at the blueberries. Oh my goodness. Wow. Well, I'm going to collect some and bring them home to my sweetheart. That looks like a highway. Whew. Looks like we might have done it. Oh. Blaze. Uh, here we are waiting at the dam depot in Latchford to go south back to Mississauga.